<laughs> I am beyond excited. Today I got in the mail something I've been waiting for for quite a while now. So a product that I thought looked amazing. And now that it's here and I've checked it out, it feels amazing and it looks stunning. And that is the S Wheel by Hyperkin. No, this isn't a sponsored video. This is just something I'm so excited about. Gabo and I and Ricky were sending pictures back to each other and we were being hilarious because we feel like we have an addiction to controllers and accessories on the Xbox and oh my gosh, oh my gosh, the S wheel. It's, 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 it's a thing of beauty, I promise ya. Oh boy. I'm not even like a super big racing guy and I'm so excited for this thing. It is beautiful. It is stunning. Uh, I know that's not all that matters, but man, this thing is a beauty to look at. It. I can feast my eyes on such splendor. This is, this is the S wheel. Right away on the top, you'll notice a glossy finish. And on the sides, you have more of a matte, uh, rubbery feel, which is obviously very important uh, for racing games, moving around the steering wheel. A another thing uh, right away that I looked for right when I got this is I was definitely not a fan of in the, you know, when the Wii got super popular and motion controls were super popular and everybody was buying, you know, the air, the air wheels for the Wii. I myself uh, did not do so because I can't stand uh, playing games like this. So when I got this, I was like, the first thing I looked for was some sort of mount and right away you have your screw hole on the back, easy mounting to, this is like the most universal size, it is what I call the tripod size because that's what I use it for. And luckily enough, right back here, I have a tripod that is on a swivel head and I can just set the tripod right in front of me, turn down the swivel head and have this steering wheel right there in front of me. Perfect, I have not tried it yet, I am so excited to try it with you guys. The controller as well, the steering wheel as well, has all the functionalities of a normal Xbox One controller. It has the paddles in the back though as well, which obviously is for shifting purposes, which isn't really my jam, I'll be honest. I am pretty terrible at racing games if I'm honest, but I do enjoy them very much. Uh, I'm a more of an automatic type racer. Now, um, all of your Xbox One buttons laid out beautifully. Um, I felt everything, I clicked around with all the buttons. Okay, I don't wanna turn it back on. I clicked around with all the buttons and it just felt great. I am excited to try this out. I will try two games with it, an arcade style game, and then I will try a more of a, a realistic racing game. I'm gonna go with Hydro Thunder on the Xbox 360, but running on an Xbox One. Oh, and also you guys, it did come with two months free of Game Pass. I just wanted to say that, and I might as well. Uh, I'm gonna give one away. So if you wanna win one, just leave a comment saying uh, you want it and uh, why, why you want Game Pass. So far I'm, I'm rating it based off looks alone, which I know you're not supposed to judge a book by its cover, but oh my gosh, I was sending this to all my friends, to Gabo and to Ricky and to NES Complex and, and Mikey and everyone's just drooling like, please, can I have it? Give it to me. And I said, no, you stay away from my steering wheel. Hyperkin, don't let me down. And no, this isn't a sponsor video. Everyone last time was like, hey, you got a sponsor video. I right, guess how many dollars they got for this video? So many dollars I got for the Hyperkin Scout controller and Cadet controller video. How about the Mega SG, Mega Retron, uh, Mega, Mega Retron Genesis thing? Zero! So if I don't like it, I will tell you because I got, I got nothing in the game. I got no skin in the game, that's the saying. Let's try this thing. Please be as amazing as you look. Just like Ricky. I'm so excited right now. I uh, I haven't done an arcade style racer like this with a steering wheel in a very long time. Press start, loading your content. Do not, my wife and I play this game very often actually together. Choose my track. All right, we're gonna do, we're gonna go to Asgard. Oh, my, okay, yeah, I've unlocked quite a few boats. Ooh, I actually like that boat a lot. Let's go! Oh my gosh! Oh my gosh, I'm so happy already. Oh my. Oh my gosh. Oh, I'm so bad already. Whenever you get them set up, it's always, you gotta remember, you gotta figure out how your controls are set. Oh my gosh, this is fantastic. Oh! Uh-oh, I forgot to tighten this. That is my bad. I probably should have tightened it. Uh, please note, if you're doing this, you should, uh, you, you should know what you're doing. <laughs> Cause I butchered that. Um, I warned you guys about how good I am at racing games or the lack thereof. Oh yeah, Hydro Thunder. 
Uh, the steering wheel itself is really grippy, which is so nice. This is not a reflection on the steering wheel. Oh my goodness gracious, me oh my. Wait. All right guys, I completely butchered that. I keep having the wrong things. I didn't have my steering wheel tightened. I didn't have certain parts of the tripod tightened. My gosh, come on Rip, get yourself together. Here we go, for real. Oh, there we go. See, I removed my rug too. I, I had my tripod sitting on a slippery surface. Probably not the best idea to do when playing a racing game, something where you're gonna be moving around. Now this is how it's supposed to feel. Oh gosh, okay. Oh my goodness gracious, me oh my. Everything feels smooth, guys. I have zero complaints right now. Uh, the sensitivity is a little hard for me right now, but that might be something, I'm sure it's something that you can fix. Your mother dresses you funny. This is one of those games that I feel like I could play all the time and just have a blast uh, because it is just silly arcade fun. Oh my goodness. Let's go, Ultra Boost. We got Hydro Rift going in here. Hydro, oh, you've heard of a drift? How about a, a rift? <laughs> Oh, I went through that in the game. Come on, game, you shouldn't give me that. In 11th now out of 16th. Okay, I'm learning to race again. I'm learning to race again because, oh boy, I'm not that good. I'll tell you that much. Um, guys, again, one of the things I wanted to say for sure is the buttons just feel really good. I know in a steering wheel, you're gonna mostly be focusing on the actual steering wheel, but uh, the buttons, the minimal buttons that I am using, I am clicking them around and stuff just so I can get a feel myself, and they feel really good. They feel really good, really, really, really good. Guys, uh, trust me, when I normally play this, uh, normally I'm in like 13th the whole time, so for me to be in 6th, I'm gonna say it's the steering wheel. I'm gonna give all... Oh, come on. You don't do that when I'm trying to compliment you, steering wheel. Don't let me, don't let me down right now. As I said it, okay, 6th place. I think that's the best score I've gotten uh, before. <laughs> See, look at this on a tripod, it's pretty sweet. I can just go in and go like, hey, I wanna tighten this, I wanna change this. I need one more match, just give me another match. Oh, we're going to Lake Powell. So far good, guys, so far so good. No issues, I wish I was like a major racer person, so, oh! So I could give you guys some sort of, you know, like, uh, some sort of critique from a pro. Uh, I talk to my buddy Gary from Rock Solid a lot, Rock Solid Productions, he is more like the tech guy, we'll give you the tech specs, we were talking about that saying how I'm the type of reviewer, quote unquote, air fingers, who is just an average gamer who, who casually likes to play. You know, I collect and I like to play and see how things feel. Uh, yeah, it's one of those things where I feel like we were talking to today and we feel like the past couple years, I'd say year and a half maybe or so, uh, hyperkin has been kind of blowing it out of the park. Not a sponsored video, but the stuff they've been sending us and, and we've been checking out, you know what, uh, we've been liking. See, this makes racing fun. It's not an air stick, it's, it's attached to something. It gives me a solid foundation to hold on to. You know, it has, like I said, the screw hole. What is it, a three-fourths, I think it's called? I might be wrong, whatever goes on a tripod. Uh, do you guys see this? Uh, top three right now, probably the highest I've ever got. Have you ever played me in Mario Kart? Oh boy, I'm a good last place every time kind of guy. Oh no, please, don't get cocky. Rick, you got cocky and now you're getting ruined. Oh boy, don't get ruined. Oh, that's the end. Oh my gosh, am I gonna get first? Come on, there he is! No, he beat me by an inch! Por que, father? Why have you forsaken me? I earned a trophy! First time in my life! And a new ring event! Wow! Let me be 100% honest with you guys, I decided not to play Forza because if I'm honest, I don't really enjoy those type of games in general anyways, so I feel like it would hinder what I actually think about the steering wheel, so I figure why not just play the game that I wanted to play on it because it's a game that I enjoy with a regular controller and I don't play Forza, so I wouldn't really be able to compare it to playing it on a regular controller. But I can say, all in all, on this, on Hydro Thunder, I had a blast playing it, it enhanced my experience for sure. I enjoyed it very much. If you like steering wheels, I can say for at least this type of game, from my experience, there's no point in me trying to convince you guys that I know how to work this and I do the paddle switches and all that. No, that's not me, so I'm not gonna pretend it's me and fake you guys out. For what I played, the arcade style racing games, I'm sure I'm gonna play more tonight. I had a great time playing it. Also, there is a charger that comes with it, obviously. It's like a little mount, it's a USB C plug as well, which I actually appreciate. I always feel like they're stronger for some reason and more durable. But you charge it in there, you just stick it in, and that's how you charge this steering wheel. I can't wait till my kids come home tonight and they're gonna wanna play this all night. Guaranteed, 
Mark my words. So from my experience, awesome, enjoyed it. Hey, Hyperkin, thank you guys. You guys have been cranking out some awesome stuff lately. And uh, that's cool, you know? I love it when you don't have to like lie, you know? I'm starting to sweat too. Whew. Time to get out of here. I don't know.